This is our third cohort of working with young men. As I said it before, I've seen some of our young men pass away. I've seen some of our young men be successful, and I see some of them that are incarcerated. One of the reasons why we're here, because we want to save your lives. But you have to want it for yourself as well. Real talk inside this South Philadelphia building. For the next 10 months, it will be transformed into a carpentry academy. But right now, these young high school kids are getting an earful about street life. It is not comfortable when somebody is after you or you go to jail or you're dead. This academy is the brainchild of Anton Moore. It's important. He runs the anti-violence organization Unity in the Community. Instead of getting somebody to do it, we taught how to do the electrical in it how to fix your doorbell, how to put up a ceiling fan. These teens will learn a trade. This bit right here, look at the head on it. Make $200 a week and go on monthly trips, all to keep them working off the streets and away from guns. In most cases, you got people who teaching kids how to use a gun. We teach them to use how to use a drill that's shaped like a gun. That matters. You're less likely to go out there and rob somebody because you know in your mind that you can do work to make money and, and take care of yourself. Moore tells NBC10 each team gets their own tool bag, but hopefully, and most importantly, he says, their own sense of self-worth. I think it's pointless kids, can like kids. It's not really the older people no more, but I think the older people are like leaning towards it, like they encouraging it now, like in some, in some part of the city, they encouraging it. And that's not cool. Those are supposed to be people like we used to look up to. Us. We sat down with three teens, not one older than 16, who have been through the academy once already. They say it gives them and other kids the chance to make money and do the right thing. The biggest thing I learned was that like people like them, like we got, we all got like the same ideas and thoughts. So like it's okay like to like talk to each other even if like you're not cool with somebody or you don't know somebody. There's a strong belief in this room community groups in Philadelphia are helping slow down gun violence inch by inch. Moore says they are the ones families see first on the ground. There's a sense of accountability when you're an organization in the neighborhood. You get to connect to those everyday folks because they see you on a consistent basis. He understands ultimately it comes down to decisions these students make outside of this environment, which is why they end every session with a word of encouragement. Be yourself when others don't believe in you. Learning more about themselves than they even realize. Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News.